pretty sweet looking boss. That's pretty sick. Um, I think I want quicker weapon here. I'm trying to remember his attacks here. I think he's just primarily melee. Pretty predictable. Um, blockable. He gets a little stronger later on, but even when he staggers us, he gives us enough time to just recoup. Bellstot, so that's his name. He's not even gonna get greedy here. Two swings is usually enough. Oh, he hit us. He hit us again. Best time to get him is after those lunges. Gotta remember for that attack though. Guess we can get three in there. Alright, yeah, he's going super power here. He's gonna get some darkness going on. And if he does hit us, he's gonna do like huge friggin' amount of damage. But other than that, nothing's really changed. I think he does have a magic attack, which we're not worried about. I think it's a big AoE attack, but it gives us enough time to dodge it. Found stamina. Oh, ouch. Heal down for a second. Heal up. That's the best time to get him is after that one. I keep getting hit by that attack right after it though. Oh! Yeah, I think he's taking less damage now that he's got the darkness going. Uh. Oh, let's just keep full health. He does two shot us, so... No need to get super careless. I guess anytime we're not attacking, we should just keep our shield up. Like that. Come on to your game. I don't know if he's getting faster at all. Oh, ouch. This guy's like, three-hit combo. Oh, he's almost dead. Good 
the stamina all the way up. Come on. Ah, uh, I got very greedy there. I decided to just go in for it, but uh, he wasn't quite dead yet. Oh, that's weird. Oh, 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 oh. Did it again. It's gonna be the death of me. I'm gonna die and he's gonna have like one hit left on him. There, now we got him. Alright, I was being way too careless that time. But, I didn't die, so... Hoorah. Alright, so... Beating him leads on to Vendrick. I did beat Vendrick in the first playthrough. It took a couple tries. He's actually, it's not that he's like hard, it's that you get punished really bad for making mistakes. Alright, the King's Ring is going to be essential to what we have to do next. There are a couple doors that require the King's Ring. Um, we could fight Velstat, or, uh, not Velstat, um, Vendrick now. The thing is, uh, his defenses are extremely high, and they decrease, um, they start decreasing when you start collecting the giant souls, which is the next portion of the game. Um, I'm trying to remember, okay, so with the King's Ring... Well, first I'm going to go to Majula, but we can start opening those King's Doors. Um, but there's another item we need, the Ashen Heart, or Ashen Mist Heart, or whatever, in order to progress. I'm thinking... So we need to find the Ancient Dragon first. Which means we need to go through the King's Door at the fork in the road. That sounds right. One, two, three, four. We got three levels. Go one. Why not boost the stamina a little bit? Thank you, ma'am. All right. Um, there is a King's Door at Drain Blade Castle, which is going to lead to the end of the game. And there's one in the Forest of the Lost Giants. Where's that? Where did I miss a bonfire in the forest? I don't know. Um, anyway, we're going to the Fork in the Road. The Ruined Fork Road. And we're going to go through that one. The King's Door there, which is gonna in turn lead all the way to the Ancient Dragon after a bunch of little areas. Um, I guess we're closing in on the last stretch of this game, if you think about it. Alright, so I need to go through the middle path now. And I actually need to equip the ring anyway. Uh, I can lose the serpent ring here. And these doors just start automatically opening when we uh, walk up to them, as long as the ring is equipped. But yeah, Vendrick, um... It's just kind of a long fight with him, and you don't have much margin for error. You could probably take a hit, but not two in a row, and he has a lot of a combo attack. So basically the fight with him is just about dodging at the right times and baiting out the attacks. He is just a melee boss, but he's a very hard-hitting melee boss. Alright, Aldeus Keep. It's an interesting little area. Give these things attention. These can petrify you, I believe. And we don't want to be petrified. Uh, yeah. 
Like I'm saying, we do not want to be petrified. Oh god. Petrified resist is going down so slow. Black Knight Albert. That's kind of awesome. Actually, I don't think I needed to use that life gem there. I think there's a bonfire right up ahead. I don't think there's anything up here either. Thank you. That guy's awfully nice. Uh, where's the other... That's a mimic. I didn't remember this one. And it's very resistant to my lightning attacks. But not very resistant to that. I'm sure I got this one before, but... Sunset Staff. Yeah, I think I got that one before. I just didn't remember it was there. Alright. Alright, and there's Lucatiel, which I think means we did everything right. Who are you? Let's listen to her. Oh. Uh, no. Forgive me. I know you. Yes, of course. How goes your journey? I know not what you seek in this faraway land. I pray for your safety. Please take these. There we go. Thank you, Lucatil. Like the whole reason we're doing this is for the achievement. That feels good. Alright, so yeah, we've got Learn All Hexes, Pyromancies, Miracles, this and Sorceries, and then Earn All Achievements. Insane. Oh, she's still talking. My name is Lucatil. I beg of you, remember my name, for I may not myself. My name, I beg for... Alright, well, that rounds out her quest. And basically the only thing I have left to do is finish this playthrough. I'm gonna speed through New Game Plus 2, um, just to get to the Chancellor and buy the rest of the uh, sorceries and whatnot that I need. There are a few more things I have to finish up in here, or in this playthrough before that, but we'll get to them. guy here is supposed to be like her brother or something. I guess. Sorry, buddy. This area is a little weird. This is pretty cool though. We check this out. It's just actually really cool to watch. Oh, it hit us. Yeah, that just happened. I thought I was in a safe spot. <laughs> um, no, I wasn't in a safe spot. I died. But it was cool, right? I went down in style, so whatever. We're right next to that spot anyway.